When I was a kid, like the superpower I have always wanted was to fly. So aviation was the closest thing I could get to that. Hi, I'm Angelina Savoy. I'm 16 and I'm an app developer and a pilot. Currently, I'm a soloed pilot. I soloed about a few months ago. I will be getting my private pilot license in a few months now that I'm 17 years old. Whenever I'm flying a plane, I'm just in awe of the world beneath me and having an entirely different perspective of the world. It was a challenge for me to become a pilot, especially because of the financial barrier to entry. When I first got started, I was overwhelmed by the price of getting licensed and all the hours I had to pursue to get licensed. So I wanted to find scholarships to fund that process. I recently developed an app called Pilot Fast Track. So Pilot Fast Track includes a large repository of flight scholarships, making it easy for any aspiring pilot to find scholarships. The app also provides scholarships specifically catered towards minorities, such as women or people of color. And I added that feature of the app because being part of the aviation industry, I felt like the majority of people were not people that looked like me. And I wanted to create a system where more minorities, such as women or people of color, felt encouraged to join that field. Another app that I made is called Pocket CPR, which is an Apple Watch based app that provides haptic feedback and guided instructions on how to properly perform CPR. I submitted Pocket CPR to the Swift Student Challenge. Swift Student Challenge is an annual program and competition that Apple hosts every year where kids around the world can submit an app made using a coding platform that Apple provides called Xcode. And this year, I was honored to be chosen as a 2022 Swift Student Challenge winner. For winning the Swift Student Challenge, I was able to visit Apple's headquarters. And at that event, I had the honor of meeting Apple CEO, Tim Cook. I wanna keep pursuing projects to help make the world a better place. Because personally, I think there's always problems in the world we can solve. And most of the time, global problems have local roots. And by tackling a small problem within your general community, you can have an impact on the global problem at hand.